Greetings from the Pacific Northwest. Grandpa, happy 90th birthday. Uh, that's an incredible accomplishment, one that I can only hope to replicate someday. I feel super thankful and blessed to have spent 22 of those 90 years with you. And I have more memories than I could ever list off here. Everything from late night card games and Monopoly games to cleaning out your pool on a hot summer day with dead squirrels and everything. I wouldn't trade it for the world. So again, Grandpa, happy birthday. I hope you have an awesome day and I will talk to you soon. Love you, Grandpa. Happy 90th birthday, Grandpa Bob. Great Grandpa Bob. We just wanted to sing this song to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, dear Grandpa Bob. Happy birthday to you. Cha cha cha. Woo woo woo. I love you. Hey, the buzz around town is that someone's got a milestone birthday coming. And we're here to wish you the very happiest birthday ever and many, many more. Can't wait till we get to see you again. Hope all's well. Hope everyone's healthy. Happy birthday, Bob. Happy birthday. Love you. Bye-bye. Hi, Uncle Bob. Happy 90th birthday. Happy 90th birthday. Happy 90th birthday. Um, longevity is in our family, and um, I'm so happy that you've made it 90 years and 90 good years, and I hope you have several more good years left after this. Um, my happiest memory ever of you is when we went to the Cleveland Metro Parks, and all those um, locusts were around, and um, I was just like so grossed out, they were everywhere. And I remember sitting on a bench, and um, you were sitting next to me, and you looked over and you said, Sandy, you have a visitor, and there they were, crawling on my on that bench. It was disgusting. But anyways, I, I loved that memory. And then also, I loved it when you used to tickle us, and you'd stop, and we had to say, house and pepper, dip and dipper. And I know that was all good fun. Now, I'm, I'm looking back, somebody could think that was kind of creepy. But um, anyways, um, that was a good memory. So, um, happy birthday. Enjoy your day. Love you. Bye. Happy birthday, Dad. Hi, Grandpa. I just want to say happy 90th birthday. Um, I was trying to think about a favorite memory, and there are definitely way more than just one. But some of the things that come to mind are watching Browns games, especially when I was in high school and early years of college at your guys' house on Sundays. Um, every game they would lose, but they are still fun to watch. And also just when me, Holly, and Phil would always stay over there basically every weekend for a while um, and just playing games, normally getting crushed and oh hell by you. Um, but those are some memories that I will never forget. Once again, happy birthday. Happy birthday, Bob. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, Mr. Jones. Happy birthday to you. No one ever asks me to sing, so I thought I'd just do it. I hope that you have a great birthday surrounded by that wonderful family. Every time I think about you and Mrs. Jones, I think about all your kids and your grandkids and your great grandkids and how awesome and blessed you are. I do wish you a very, very happy 90th. I can't believe it's 90. You're probably the hottest grandpa around. But I want you to know I'm thinking about you and long live the Joneses. Happy birthday. Hello, Bob. I'm very happy and pleased to be greeting you on your 90th for your 90th birthday, and who would have believed that 
three such wonderful Jones children, Phyllis, 92, Bob, 90, and Delphia Ann would live to be 88. Those three advanced ages are wonderful, and we can't take that for granted. I remember you so much when we were growing up, Bob, how we used to roller skate out in the front street on 6th Street, which was a nice cement street, and we used to play ball down in the ball field, and <clears throat> used to ride our bikes to Waterworks Park. Um, if I had to have a close sibling, <clears throat> I'm glad it was you. And I appreciate it in <clears throat> your later years when you got to be a, a good companion for Bill my dear Bill, and we always enjoyed doing things with you and Barbara and Bill and I, and I'll just have wonderful memories, memories, memories forever. Love you, Bob. Happy birthday and many more. Oh, fiddlesticks. This is like my third time recording this. Uh, hopefully I'll get it right this time. So, uh, <clears throat> Grandpa, on your 90th birthday, uh, I just wanted to share a memory I had of a conversation uh, we had in the living room of your house. And uh, we were talking about how I really want to be a lawyer and I was all excited to make a lot of money. I was 12. And uh, <clears throat> you mentioned to me like, well, there's nothing wrong with being a lawyer, but um, the world doesn't need more lawyers as much as it needs other things. And, uh, you know, it didn't dawn on me right away exactly, you know, how much sense that made. But over time, I've really thought about that a little bit. And that's part of why I'm doing what I'm doing now. Um, I love being an educator, and I know that's a profession that you did for a long time, too. So um, that was just a really cool thing that you shared with me that I didn't fully grasp right away. But over time, I really uh, thought about it more and thought it was a really wise thing to have said. So anyway, happy birthday. Uh, love you very much. Hope to see you soon. Bye. Happy 90th birthday, Grandpa Bob. I hope you have a great day and even better year. One of my fondest memories is always seeing you at church with your big smiles and warm hugs. Hope to get to see you soon. Love you. like a wreck but what else is new uh, you can see the ponies in the background there um, I think of you all the time when I'm here on the farm dad and it was so fun having you and mom out here yesterday and you won at cards and anyhow hope you're having a great party we love you very much and um, are very blessed to have you as a dad Love you, Dad. Happy birthday, Grandpa Bob. I hope this next trip around 